In this video, I'm going to show you how to pair and unpair the Pet Control HQ dog training collars to your remote control. Before we begin, please note that the collars will arrive paired to the remote control on purchase. The collar with the black strap will be paired to dog selection button 1, and the collar with the orange strap will be paired to dog selection button 2. If they are paired, then the following procedure is not required. You should charge the collars and the remote control for 6 to 8 hours before their first use. Pair one collar at a time while leaving the other collar turned off. Once the devices are sufficiently charged, start by making certain the collar is turned off. If there is no LED light whatsoever coming from the collar for more than 5 seconds, the collar is already off. If you see a green blinking light, hold the power button on the collar down until you hear an extended beep sound. Once you let go of the button, the red light should turn off and the collar will be off. Once the collar is off, turn on the remote by holding down the power button. You'll see a letter and digits appear on the remote screen indicating the remote is turned on. Now turn one of your collars on by holding down the power button until you hear several beeps. If the green LED light on the collar blinks once every five seconds, it is in dual mode. Dual means two, and to pair the collar to the remote, the collar must be in dual mode. In dual mode, the collar will work with both your remote control and your dog fence system simultaneously. If the collar is blinking twice every five seconds, it is in single mode. Single meaning one, so the collar will only work with the dog fence, it will not work with the remote control. To switch between dual and single modes, hold down the power button on the collar until you see the LED light turn red. Once the light turns red, release your finger immediately off the power button. Remember, to pair the collar to the remote, it must be in dual mode, so make sure the light is blinking once every 5 seconds. Next, put the remote in unmatched pairing mode by holding down the lightning bolt button and the bell button at the same time on your remote control. Hold them down until the numbers on the screen start running. The remote is now ready to unpair the collar in unmatched mode. To pair the first collar, bring the remote very near the collar while avoiding touching the prongs with the antenna and press one of the three dog selection numbers on the remote. Several consecutive beeps will sound and this will set the collar into unpaired matched mode, indicated by the light on the collar rapidly blinking continuously. Now hold down the lightning bolt and bell button simultaneously again on the remote until the numbers on the screen stop running. Once the numbers stop running, the remote is no longer in unmatched mode. Next, hold down the plus sign and the lightning bolt buttons simultaneously on the remote until the numbers start running again. Once the numbers start running, the remote is ready to be paired to the collar. Now the antenna of the remote must be touching the collar next to where the green LED light is on the collar and hold down either of the dog selection buttons, one, two, or three, on the remote until you hear several consecutive beeps come from the collar. Whichever number you select will be assigned to the collar. Finally, take the remote out of pairing matching mode by holding down the plus sign button and the lightning bolt button simultaneously until the numbers on the screen stop running. You have now paired the first collar to the remote. To test the connection, make sure the remote is not on top of the collar. The remote should be at least three feet away. Press the button number you assigned to the collar and then press the bell button. You should hear a beep from the collar. If you press the vibrate button, the collar should vibrate. If you hold the test light bulb to the prongs on the collar and press the lightning bolt button, you should see the test light bulb light up. Before pairing the second collar, hold down the button on the first collar to turn it off. We'll follow the same process up until the end to pair the second collar. Start by holding down the button on the second collar until the green light appears. It should flash once every 5 seconds indicating it's in dual mode. Bring the remote very close to the collar. Set the remote to unpairing unmatching mode again by holding down the bell and lightning bolt buttons until the numbers on the screen start running. Press either button 1, 2, or 3 on the remote, it doesn't matter which one at this point, until several consecutive beeps are heard. The collar light should now start blinking rapidly. Next, hold down the bell and lightning bolt buttons until the numbers on the screen of the remote stop. Now we'll put the remote in pairing matched mode, beginning by holding down the lightning bolt and plus buttons until the numbers on the screen start running. Hold the antenna of the remote next to where the green LED light on the collar is and press a number other than the number you assigned to the first collar. Several consecutive beeps will be heard. 
The light on the collar should now only blink once every five seconds. Finish by holding down the plus sign and lightning bolt buttons until the numbers on the remote screen stop running. You've now paired the second collar to the remote. To test, remember to not place the remote on top of the collar and keep them at least three feet apart. Select the number you assign to the second collar. If you press the bell button, you should hear a beep from the collar. If you press the vibrate button, the collar should vibrate. If you hold the test light bulb to the prongs on the collar and press the lightning bolt button, you should see the test light bulb light up. To use both collars at the same time, make sure they're both powered on and select the corresponding number on the remote to use one collar and press the other corresponding number on the remote to use the other collar. You can pair a third collar to the remote control. The remote control has three dog selection buttons and you can control three dogs simultaneously from your remote control. You're now ready to control the paired collars with your remote. Available now on Amazon.com. Click the link in the description to get this product today at the best price. Why shop at Amazon? Well, it's certainly one of the most convenient places to shop given the fact that it's the world's largest online retailer, but also because it offers free two-day shipping for Amazon Prime members and it's offering deals in a number of categories that most of its competition can't match. Get ready to seize the massive discounts and deals on various categories such as mobiles, electronics, laptops, home appliances, televisions and many more. Don't forget to leave a comment, share and subscribe to my channel. Click the link in the description to get this product today at the best price.